Shifting our focus to Gaza now, where Israel launched airstrikes against Gaza on Monday night, saying they were only responding to the launches of incendiary balloons from the Gaza Strip. Blaming Hamas for the balloons, the Israeli army said that it had targeted locations of the Hamas militant group that controls the Gaza Strip. This includes a Hamas rocket manufacturing workshop, as well as a Hamas military compound. There were no reports of casualties. Earlier in the day, Israel firefighters had said that incendiary balloons had caused three bushfires in the sites close to the Gaza Strip. Launching the makeshift devices is a common tactic of militants in Gaza, which Israel has blocked it for nearly 15 years now. Israel frequently responds to such attacks with airstrikes. Monday strikes come after six Palestinians broke out of an Israeli prison earlier in the day through a tunnel, triggering a massive manhunt. Tensions between Hamas and Israel have been tense in the past year. In May, the two fought a devastating 11-day conflict, though it ended with an Egypt-brokered ceasefire and a pledge for Qatari aid to ease poverty in Palestinian enclave. Incendiary balloons and occasional border clashes have continued in the recent months. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.